All right, uh, I thought today was uh, another good day. You know, coming off the second scrimmage, you really challenged the guys yesterday about uh, you know what we wanted your practice to look like. You know, the the urgency, the competitiveness. You know, tried to script it to create more uh, competitive situations. You know, got some uh, uh, a little bit of series work there at the end, just forcing forcing guys to continue to have to you know take ownership of down landmarks on the field. Uh, your know, situation of the game. Got some some overtime. Um, your situations put in. Uh, you're just continuing to to see these guys grow in their knowledge and uh, you know overall uh, you know understanding of, of, of what to expect and uh, you know just continuing to work on the fundamentals and details of being able to execute uh, you know at a higher level. But uh, you know I've, I've been pleased with the with the uh, with the workload. I thought you know today you guys you know, you know, explosive plays on both sides of the ball. Um, you know you felt you felt the speed. I thought the guys came out and you know, worked at a high level. So it was a it was a good good practice. Run game and those team situations seem to be pretty crisp. Yeah, it's uh, you're getting better. You know, it's one of those things that you just, uh, you know, as you're as you're working, you know, different schemes, you know, different looks. Um, you're trying to trying to make sure that it, it does come down to, you know, the details and fundamentals. Are you are you, are you doing a good job with your landmarks, whether it's O line, tight ends, receivers, um, you know, obviously backs, tracks, uh, you know, things, you know, different elements. I thought our quarterback's management of the run game has uh, been getting, you know, much better. And, uh, you know, they, the way that they've you know, kind of taken control of that, understanding checks, under, understanding different looks that, um, you know, of what we, what we like to see and, you know, different ways to be able to, uh, to mix it. Um, but I thought, it was, I thought guys did well. After watching film, was DJ as good as you thought he was after the scrimmage, and did he carry over, carry it over a little bit? Yeah, you know, I thought uh, I thought he had a really good scrimmage, um, you know, um, and then I thought today, you know, saw some really good things. So I'm excited, and I thought Brock, you know, you know, it's 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 fun to see the you know him growing up into you know this second year and just where he's where he's at. Um, you know, it's just that, that steady progress, that steady uh, growth. Um, I thought both those guys did some really good things today, too. Well, no, I mean, and that was the challenge. I mean, he was one that got you know, challenged this last few days. And, you know, in the, in the scrimmage, he made a couple of good plays um, you know, that we need him to step up and make. And, you know, then today I, I thought you felt him. And, I mean, there's been, you know, a few days where you haven't in this uh, – in the spring ball, and that's, you know, that was uh, well received, and you know, uh, I guess um, the point the point got across because he he was definitely really good today. Brock had a really big run. I don't know if you could, I don't want to keep everything away, but like, was that something he, should, he was dialed up specifically for him to keep, or was that him just playing good football and interpreting things well? Yeah, interpreting. He was a great interpreter there. His athleticism. Oh, he went over. He, so I mean, he went over 20 miles per hour on that run. So I mean, it was speed, athleticism, like you, like that's where you could see the strength. You, I mean, that's something we tend to forget. You know, when guys um, as they go through the process of their uh, uh, you know career, you know, you see them get stronger. You see the agility improve. This, the confidence, the movements. But yeah, no, he was he was flying. In the scrimmage, obviously we know you've got a lot of veteran offensive linemen, but you've got some young guys trying to make a name for themselves, work themselves in rotation. Did any of those guys stand out when you watched the film in the scrimmage? Yeah, you know, I'm a, well, I'm an older guy that I think has had a hell of a spring that I really I want to yeah, is uh, Bryson Estes. Like, I, I think he's having the – he's playing the best football he's played since he's been here. Um, I'm proud of him. And, you know, he's – He's really worked hard. Um, you know, he's playing faster, playing more confident. And I mean, going back and watch, I thought he did a really nice job. I'm seeing you know Jalen Early, uh, Lucas Simmons, um, you know Andre Otto. I mean, those guys are doing they're doing a good job. You know, it's 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 an, an good to see that growth. I mean, even with the newcomers that have that have joined in, uh, those guys are really coming along. But um, I'm excited about that group. I think we got a lot of talented guys that uh, have an opportunity, and uh, you know, just continue to compete. DJ's kind of improved at the last few times. Just that him playing so much football and knowing when to when to turn it on, or it's just him being now. Well, oh, I, I just think it's reps. I mean, like you, you it's like if you go in and you learn. I mean, he's learned three different languages in, th in whatever I guess the last three years. And you know, everything's got. There will be times where that helps the process just to, because of experience. Uh, but it's still, you know. I mean, we we do things a certain way, and we get certain reads, certain timing, certain you know elements that. Um, you know, to the offense that, you know, I thought would be a really good fit for him. And just as you see him building confidence in that, it's, it's exciting. It's exciting to, to see the, uh, 
uh, you, his growth, um, you know, I think his consistency is something I've been pleased with the last few days. Like, you know, you're, you're eliminating the, 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 the uncertainty in times, uh, and it's only going to continue to improve as, as we, uh, you know, move closer you know, to the end of spring ball, but then also as we get, you know, closer to, to fall camp. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Coach.